Hey everyone. Today I'm diving into the fascinating world of early humans and the Stone Age. Buckle up because we are traveling way back in time. The Stone Age is a monumental period in human history, split into three major parts, Paleolithic, Mesolithic, and Neolithic. Imagine humans using stone tools and weapons for everything. The Paleolithic Age, or Old Stone Age, was all about survival with simple stone tools. Then came the Mesolithic Age, where they refined these tools and began to settle down. Finally, the Neolithic Age, the New Stone Age, where agriculture, pottery, and permanent settlements took root. Now let's talk about human evolution. Early humans lived in jungles using stone tools to hunt, gather, and protect themselves. They ate raw food, including meat, as they hadn't discovered fire yet. Their first companion? The dog. These loyal animals helped with hunting and protection. Over time, humans noticed grains growing by riversides and started cultivating crops. This was huge. It marked the beginning of agriculture and settled communities. Fire was another game changer. At first, humans feared it, but soon they realized cooked food tasted better and was safer. Before agriculture, early humans were nomadic, moving constantly in search of food and water. They wore animal skins and lived in caves, using stone tools for hunting and processing food. This nomadic lifestyle gradually shifted as they learned to grow crops and settle down. The Stone Age wasn't just about survival, it was also about innovation. The invention of the wheel from rolling stones and the development of pottery for storage and cooking were groundbreaking. Archaeological excavations in places like Tamil Nadu have uncovered coins, potsherds and metal objects offering us a glimpse into ancient life. These findings, preserved in museums, help us connect with our past and understand our shared human heritage. So there you have it. The journey from nomadic hunter-gatherers to settled agricultural communities is a testament to human ingenuity and resilience. Thanks for watching and stay curious.